It's the most critical ingredient for a successful ski resort, snow. And when Mother Nature can't deliver, the Whistler Blackcomb snowmaking team steps into high gear. I decided to tag along and see how it works. Hi. Hey, how's it going? Good, I'm Heather. I'm Heather as well. Hi, easy to remember. <laughs> Hi, I'm Pat. Hi, Pat. So you guys are in charge of snowmaking. That we are. And uh, I want to learn how it works. We can take you up and show you that. We'll just uh, get you to throw a helmet on here and we'll head over to the rhinos and we'll head up. Perfect. Helmets on, we're ready to go. Rhinos will be our mode of transportation. Buckle up, this could be a wild ride. Snowmaking is not as smooth as it may seem. There's definitely an enormous amount of science to it. Snow science, atmospheric science, weather models, there's that whole side and then there's basic experience in learning how to use the wind and the natural environment around you to get the, the quality that you want. Working our way up the mountain, the rugged ride is well worth it for the breathtaking view. Our first stop is the heart of the operation. Wow, so this is it. This is the mechanics of the whole job. This is, this is a Horseman Creek pump house. Uh, we have several pump houses like this dispersed all over both mountains, Whistler and Blackcomb. The pumps here will put 700 gallons per minute of water. So basically, they act as either a pump site to draw water uphill, as well as help push and disperse throughout the mountain to gain the pressure we need in the lines that feed the snow guns. During a production window like this, where it's cold, minus eight to minus 10, uh, very cold, allows us to make a lot of snow. So roughly right now, four to five million gallons a day per mountain. The water is pumped out through a main line with hydrants, which runs the length of the hill equipped with snowmaking. Machine made or otherwise, it's clear as we arrive at the crystal zone, winter is here. So this is it. Here we are. I can tell why you like this as your office. Yeah. It's beautiful. It's Picture nice. a football field with five feet of snow on it. These snow guns make that amount every few days. So tell me, how many uh, how many guns do we have here right now? This is the crystal zone. This is the new crystal zone. So in the new crystal zone right now, we have roughly 18 guns running. Both mountains combined, the snowmaking team operates close to 200 snow guns. The new 30 amp autos in crystal, they're all automatic. So each of them have their own weather station. And based on settings we program, adjust themselves to make the best quality snow with our help. Then it all comes down to a mixture of high pressure water and air to create the fluffy white stuff. So there's a air compressor on each gun, a water feed within the inter workings of the gun. It creates crystals and then falls from the sky like natural. Snow guns working round the clock, they're creating the perfect popping snow. Just what Whistler Blackcomb guests will be looking for this winter. From Whistler, I'm Heather Butts for Shaw TV.